How to add payment getaway in Canva website. Hello everyone and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can create your website or publish your website. Then if you have a online store, how to add a payment getaway or a, a payment link to your store, then the customers can buy your product and you can get some profit. And the uh, platform that we will be using to get our payments is SquareUp. SquareUp is a platform that collect uh, payments from different sites that you will publish and you only have to get your customized or your own payment link from SquareUp. Then you can collect the sales or the payments uh, through here. Then you can take them outside to your bank account or PayPal or something like this. Uh, you have first to get or create your website all you have to do is to use uh, simply canva you search for a template uh, named websites you create your own website for me i have already created a website and i have published it this is a, a blank website so i'm not going to work with this i have to uh, redesign or modify my previous website here is my previous website you can see that it is already published I'll, I can republish it Square up uh, dashboard is used to calculate and make the analytics of the sales that you've made all you have to do is to uh, create products in the items or orders section I will create one for you so you can get a clear idea for what am my going to do or make you can import items or create an item this platform is used to collect payments it is very 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 useful uh, I use it uh, to get my payments there are three methods you can add this square up platform or it is because it is very simple or you can make your stripe uh, for example URL since I don't have a stripe in my country I can't uh, create it because it needs a business account and a lot of legal information uh, of course if you have a business a stripe is uh, the best solution for you but for my case, I will use Square Up, or either you can also uh, create a uh, PayPal button using another extension. If you want to uh, create the PayPal, I will not suggest it, but you can do that since it has uh, some uh, some steps uh, to go further. So it will be demanding some codes then it will be integrated in the Canva app or the Canva website that you have created. For now, I will use the Square Up dashboard. I will name my product. I can, for example, add the uh, image of the clothes and I will take this example. You can add the images and uh, drag and drop from your desktop. The description you can uh, generate it with AI it is very simple it's not very complicated here it is very simple now for the locations I let it as it is I don't have to make a lot of difficult things the options such as the size color material and everything the variation you can add your own variations for the modifiers you can add some modifiers custom attributes check out behavior uh, now the sell online here you can uh, make the square online payment links or you can use the meta uh, business suit to link your profile here so you can get paid with the meta uh, the subscription you can add a subscription the online uh, checkout you can create a payment link or by button you can activate it here you must first save this item before you get a link this is a simplified way uh, to create a product and I have to save 
it will guide us to another window here is uh, the product so we can add our payment link all you have to do is to go to the payment you can choose either one of these uh, selections but all we need is a payment link here I have created uh, a, an example for the payment link but I will create another link so you can uh, get the clear idea about it I create a link you choose a purpose uh, for me I will take payments I will continue with this here is a preview for the uh, box that will show up to the clients when you put your link through here it needs some details for example green sweatshirt you can add any amount or exact amount I will put my amount for for example $25 the frequency it is one time because it is not a subscription if you want to add a subscription you can make the weekly frequency since it is uh, one item to be bought you only need a one time the description you can add a description or you don't have to you have to upload the images you click on upload and I select my image for example like this I have to save it there you have to customize the images so it will goes with the banner so it will not be awkward and the clients will see your uh, product as it is so so to avoid the scams now for the checkout you can add some custom fields you can add the tipping bar see the real-time editing live here for the tip add a tip you can add a 15 percent 20 percent 25 percent and customizable uh, now for the confirmation you can redirect a to a website after the checkout or make the confirmation for example thank this payment is confirmed and thank you for the payment all you have to do now is to save the template is the preview link this is our link we can preview it you can add a button now this is the buying page uh, this business is currently not accept accepting payments because I didn't activate or verify my identity you have to verify your identity to be able to use these uh, links but it is not a problem all I have to do here is to copy this link then I go back to my Canva let's say for example this is my website and uh the, this lady right here is selling a service for example i will edit my design here a description uh, of the services for example i have to add a button and select any type of button that we want uh, like this it looks like a buying button I will add a text to the button Let's choose this by now like this here I will change the color for this to white it looks appealing okay let's for example uh, make this button clickable you can click the right button of the mouse you click on link the link here you have to copy it then you have to insert the link or paste it right here you click on done it is linked and all you have to do is to publish the website in my case it is published already I only have to republish the website then it will be a clickable button I will be showing you that in an instance it is live now I will visit my website this is my website I have created uh, the freelance services and now as you can see the buy button the buy uh, text is clickable you can see uh, at the um, uh, bottom of the uh, screen the screen uh, the link itself 
you click on it and you will be redirected to the uh, buying buying page all you have the, the client all he has to do or, or the client have to uh, have the choices that you make for the products and they check out then you get the payment when they finish the payment I think that's all uh, for today's video guys I want to thank you uh, so much for watching and I catch you on the next video